first heard about First Line Therapy about three and a half years ago, 2010. I went for an annual physical at Jerry Medical Center, um, spoke with my physician about the fact that I was concerned with my extra weight and was ready to do something about it. I told her what kinds of things I was interested in and she said, it sounds like you might be interested in first line therapy and Sue Olson has to be, happens to be right next door. She came in and Sue was so enthusiastic, so excited about the program and it was contagious. I wanted to be part of it. It sounded like just what I needed and I signed up and I've been a member ever since, mm -hmm. enjoying it. And um, I lost 45 pounds in three dress sizes and I've been able to maintain that for the three and a half years. Um, but the best part is not the losing the weight so much as feeling good, being energetic, um, uh, being able to sleep better, just overall uh, feeling much healthier. Mm -hmm. So I'm forever grateful to her mm -hmm. and to First Line Therapy. I really enjoy it. I used to be very fond of carbs, uh, desserts. Um, I didn't pay a lot of attention to what I ate, would feel badly afterwards, but um, just kind of ate and then regretted it later. Now I'm very focused on what I eat. I pay, pay attention. Um, I have goals. Uh, very very um, involved in having a balanced diet, exercise, um, reducing my stress, and in general feeling better about myself. Well, I try to exercise every day. I live near a beach, so I try to walk on the beach. Uh, if the weather is not conducive to that, I go to the Y and exercise there. I do some weight training. I do the treadmill or the bike. Um, when I'm at home, we have lots of stairs, so I try to go up and down the stairs as often as I can. Um, park a little farther away from the store or just be a little bit more aware um, of how I could get a few more steps in if I can't get my regular exercise program. So um, in the winter, you know, there's always the store you can walk around. In the summer, if it's hot, you have an air-conditioned store, so they help out a lot. I changed my, um, my whole way of dealing with food. I love to use the menu worksheet. Um, it helped me to make better choices about food, helped me keep track of uh, the good foods, helped me include foods I never ate before. I was never fond of legumes. I never ate Greek yogurt before. I now eat that. I never ate enough fruits and vegetables, so the menu worksheet is helpful in terms of um, suggestions and how many servings of each I need. Uh, you can just check things off or write things down as you, as you use them, so that's been very helpful. Other strategies would be not getting myself in those situations where I'm starving and I grab the candy as I go out the checkout uh, aisle. I used to be famous for eating candy while I shopped and then passing in the empty wrapper to pay for my, <laughs> my choice. Uh, now I will pack uh, some nuts or something in the car. One of the Metagenics um, medical bars are great. Try to keep those on hand. Uh, I try to always have water so that that would fill me up a little bit and get me to the, the next point. So there are lots of little strategies, little hints and suggestions that I've learned from First Line Therapy from, from my health educators, and I appreciate them. They help me to make better choices. Record keeping for me is what made the difference. I think you can try to keep a checklist in your head, but you forget all those little things. If you write things down, it helps to keep you honest. I love the, the check sheet, the menu worksheet. I love the, the daily logs for, for exercise, whether it's a pedometer log or a, um, just a log of other kinds of exercise, it helps to keep me honest, helps to keep me on track, helps to keep me fo focused, mm -hmm. and um, thinking about it all the time, thinking about making better choices. It's very helpful to come to the um, meeting with my health educator with all of the information, with the check sheets, with um, notes that I've made to myself about what I did on days when I didn't make good choices or I did make good choices, and then we could sit and discuss them and come up with new goals. I would leave each time with with goals for the next time. How could I fit in more exercise? How could I get in legumes when I don't like beans? Or how could I get in more calcium when I uh, don't drink milk? Um, the health educator is invaluable in making first-line therapy work within your own lifestyle and your, your interests and in your um, tastes.
you know, your, your food choices. So I really appreciated that part of the program. After three and a half years, I'm still excited about the program. I'm, I'm going to sign up today for another year. I would recommend it to anybody who's interested in becoming healthier and improving their lifestyle. Uh, it's good for anyone at any age, single, married, with children, senior citizen like myself. It makes a huge difference in, um, in combating chronic illness, in um, how you feel. I I've been a migraine sufferer my whole life, and since I started first line therapy, I don't have migraines. Um, all my all my lab results, all my test results are good. I don't take any medication, and I'd like to keep it that way as I get older. I I want to just kind of I know as you get older, you're apt to develop something. So if your weight is under control and you exercise, you probably stand a better chance of um, dealing with those chronic illnesses. So. Um, I'm very happy to be a member of First Line Therapy and I hope to continue and benefit from the program.